Hey everybody, it's me. I'm back. I'm just going to do some gluing in my glue book tonight. Just going to play in my... Again, I've started before I'm ready. <laughs> um, I'm just going to play in my Chunky Monkey. Chunky Funky. My Funky Chunky. All of a sudden, it does, nothing sounds right. <laughs> <laughs> I need to put the name on the book so I will remember exactly what I'm calling it. Okay, I think it's a, my, my chunky junkie. <laughs> chunky junkie. It's chunky and it's full of junk, but my favorite junk. So, anyway, I did a couple pages. I've been having tea. I totally forgot to have coffee this morning. And I didn't even remember until, um, gosh, what was, when did I remember? I remembered, um, I don't even, you know, I'm not even sure what I'm going to put in here. Um, I didn't even remember about my coffee until it was too late. Too late to, um, To have it because you know I can't drink coffee uh, too late in the afternoon or I won't sleep and I'm already not sleeping I'm already up but tomorrow I need to get up early I've got things to do and I'm making potato soup for dinner for friends and my uh, granddaughter and her boyfriend and my friends so oh and the, oh, okay <laughs> I looked everywhere for a, a map and I thought that was a, a road map <laughs> but I didn't see that um I don't know what's in this here's just some um brochures that I've been hanging on to oh in 1972 I went to the Grand Old Opry that was pretty fun I think I want my brochures to open But maybe just these two pages. Coca Cola Museum is fun in E Town. Oh, maybe I won't put that there because it's just. Um, What do I want in this? I don't know if I want to cut that up. I maybe need to put on some, <clears throat> grab some uh, background papers and get started. I'm kind of in a blah, not really blah, but kind of a, um, actually not really blah at all. There. I've been wanting to put that somewhere. It can go next to the Coke Museum. Um, I'm kind of at loose ends, I should say. I didn't really have anything I had to do today and uh, or this weekend, and I kind of rested up. I had a wonderful uh, visit with my granddaughter who came and spent the night. Uh, she's working on her college scrapbook. So, um, I'm having a hard time not advising, <laughs> letting her, her just do it the way she likes to do it. Um, I, I, I'm always, I, I found myself, you know, jumping in and saying, oh, uh, 
and let's do this and let's you know <laughs> or do it this way or whatever and I realize I don't have to do that I would not want anybody to do that to me so anyway it, it wasn't too long before I realized that that um, I was being insufferable <laughs> Oh, let's see. Here's a leg. I'll just put that in there. If I can get my hands unsticky enough to throw away my papers. But um, yeah, I've been uh, I've been kind of busy and having uh, having fun and 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 doing things. I haven't been um, um, particularly at, uh, at well. I uh, went out to um, went out to downtown festival which was really uh, fun to get out and do something and uh, they had live music and food trucks and um, Festival of the Arts, I'll put that in here. And just um, lots of fun things. Uh, but the most fun was is everybody was there. Um, my son, my daughter, uh, granddaughter, my friend, and my granddaughter, my daughter-in-law uh, was in charge of the event, and her family was there too. So it was um, it was just very very fun. Oh, here's a here's a piece of washi that I don't want to lose. I'll just stick that there. And I don't know if I need anything else here. Maybe this. I'll tear this piece out. And this was from a long time ago when I used to have my Disney pass and I went all the time. And I went to the Festival of the Arts. At Epcot, and that was fun. Um, been watching a little bit of TV. Uh, it was kind of fun to watch it again after uh, not having the option of watching TV. That makes you really want to watch some TV. <laughs> So, so I've done some of that. Some I've been spending time at the at the television, and oh, uh, I did wake up the other morning and I took a I took um, uh, pictures of the sunrise. And I took a bunch of pictures and put them together and made a little video of the sunrise at my house. That was kind of nice. I, I really enjoyed that. Let's um, cut some of that down. Get some backgrounds on here. I just feel like gluing. I don't feel like thinking. I don't want to stay up too late um, because I want to wake up early in the morning and have some coffee. <laughs> and I have to go, um, what do these say? Way to go, good times. I'll just put good times. Oh, I don't want the, yeah, I'll just put good times on there. It always was a good time. Um, ooh, 
that will be pretty in my black and white. Not my black and white, but my, um, I don't know if this is going to be a good journal to work in. I don't know about these things. They don't seem to want to. But then again, if I don't force it, who cares? I'll do it that way. I mean, I'm just pulling out stuff and throwing it in there. I've watched a couple of Dawn's videos. And um, while I've uh, been in bed. Um, and... Liz Drake has been putting out content recently. So this is going to be my neon journal. But I may have to do something different. I'm thinking I'm wanting to take these off and putting three rings on here. But I don't know if I can take those off. I maybe use wire cutters or something. Because these don't seem to want to... They don't want to turn. They turn if I work them, but they don't want to turn on their own. We'll see. We'll see how that plays out. That's not what I'm working in today, but... Hey, you know, I've set things back intending to put them in another journal and and um, I don't ever get to it. I'm pretty much um, at the end of this one. I only have, well, it seems like I'm at the end of this one, but I really do have a lot of pages, but I haven't been um, I haven't been spending a lot of time just gluing. So, so anyway, um, it was kind of interesting um, uh, being out the other night because it, the weather was so nice. The weather was absolutely beautiful. And um, you couldn't have asked for a nicer, um, nicer event. And with my grandson there, he was just so cute. He's so easy to take places. Well, he's getting a little more, where a little more uh, running. I never see anybody else tear. When they're gluing. I tear all the time. This reminds me of, um, was it, um, it was a stage show. It was all about drums, but it wasn't called drums. It was called something else, but it was like a one word title and I can't think of what it was. And I'm just reaching in here and finding Uh, papers and I'm not going to be fussy they're just going to go on here whatever I pull out that's cute and I think I'll Do that, and then let me see if I've got some um, get into my oh. 
Oh, I know, I wanted to put this. I saved this border. things around. This came right out of a magazine, um, a Pioneer Woman magazine, and her pages all had borders on them. They were really nice. I want to put it on the inside because I want to use washi on the outside part. And um, I am going to love that, that Pioneer Woman magazine. Is it right here? Yes, Pioneer Woman. And look how it's got borders all the way around on all these pages and I'm thinking, Wow, I love that. But this particular issue is for the fall, so I kind of want to save it for the fall. But there's a lot in here. Look, look at that. Isn't that pretty? I don't think I already showed you this. But anyway, a lot of the pages, even the cover has that border. Who did I see? Oh, <laughs> um, I was going to tell you a story too. I, I decided to get a, um, I decided to get a, 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 a little, um, um, like an emergency radio because after the tornado, Nothing worked. I The only thing that I could do was text. And it was fine because it, it was fine in a way because um, uh, everybody was online and they were they were texting me. Not all the texts came through really well. So, you know, it was just hard to get information um, when we needed it. And um, I didn't have a radio when, when the storms were coming through. I had the radio prior to the storms coming through. But there, that's what I'll put on there. But, um, it was frustrating, and so um, so I ordered this emergency radio, <laughs> and it has like a flashing light, uh, and just a regular flashlight, then a brighter flashlight, then a flashing light, and um, it's really cool. Um, it has um, this thing that will help if you get if you get caught like underneath something like if you're in an earthquake or something and the house crumbles on you or the building or your or a bunch of trees or something it's got this little um, dog whistle that will alert dogs who might be looking for people got that and it's got um, it's got like it's it has an it's plugged in all the time and then when it works it's got a um, if it runs down if the power goes out and it runs down it's got a battery that's a really really long lasting battery but if the battery runs down it has um, a hand crank and you crank it for one minute to listen to nine minutes on the radio. So that seems pretty reasonable. Um, and you have AM, FM, and the Weather Channel is what I have on 
the weather bands and the AM FM radio. And so I think, um, I think that will be really handy. And as soon as you have a weather alert, it, there's like a, it goes off. It has this big noise to let you know that there's uh, bad weather coming, which is um, important. So, um, so anyway, so I got it. <laughs> I got it, and it um, it went off and woke me up in the middle of the night. And I'm thinking, oh, okay, okay, got something going on. And I'm listening, and I'm listening, and... Um, Uh, nothing. He just keeps going off, going off, going off. And then when it was done going off, nothing, nothing happened. And I thought, well, heck, what's going on here? And um, <laughs> it did it a second time in the, in the morning. And then I looked on my, I looked on my uh, phone and saw that it was just a thunderstorm, severe thunderstorm warning. Okay, so I went back to sleep and then in the morning it goes off again, telling us about the th severe thunderstorm warning. Okay, and it went off for the longest time and it didn't come back on. Well, it happened a third time later on. And I'm thinking, oh my goodness, this is going to be a nightmare. I don't know if I'm gonna like this because it's not telling me anything, it's just, um, it's an alarm, but it's supposed to be telling me, um, it's supposed to give me um, the weather information. So I thought, well, I don't know what I'm getting here. Um, I, I get here, I, I, I can't hardly talk and do this and think. And this is supposed to be all the relaxing, but I'm not feeling relaxed here. Uh, I'm not smoothing out and relaxing because I'm telling this story. And it's taking me forever. Okay. Long story short. <laughs> Too late. Um, I decided I, I have to read the directions. So I went in and I read the directions and it turns out that you have to hit the button to stop the alarm. It goes off for a full minute. And let me tell you, when that shrieking alarm is going off, a full minute seems like a long time. <laughs> Nobody's going to sleep through that. So uh, you have to put in, you have to touch that, and then it goes to the weather channel. Doesn't, it doesn't stop the alarm until it knows that you've heard the alarm and you've gotten up and you're addressing the situation. Okay, that sounds reasonable. All right, I can live with that. So, um... needed something there it seemed kind of plain um, <clears throat> so by the time I figured out what it was I wasn't um, I wasn't uh, <clears throat> uh, there wasn't any emergency the storm had passed and we didn't have any emergencies for a while well it finally went off again tonight and I was able to get there in the minute to hit the weather uh, thing, and again, it's another uh, major thunderstorm warning. So, um, so I'm going to. Um, is this my papers?
So I, I don't have to do anything because I'm not too worried about it. I don't live in a flood zone. I don't have any, any of those issues. So anyway, um, I'm glad to know how the thing works because it was driving me nuts. And it was quite expensive to be driving me nuts. Do I really want that that letter? Don't know if I want that letter. I want to use that guy. Well, these are all the. This isn't what I want. Those are the. I want this. I just want background pieces. I love that, but I want to save that. <laughs> I should put that down at the bottom. Is that what I really pulled? Did I really pull that out for that? I don't think so. Did I pull it out for that? I don't know. I like kind of like that. I'm thinking. Now I don't want to cover it up. Okay. I'm not sure I really want a big red F on that. tape here. Here's one of the cups that I bought at the um, thrift store. I just cannot resist a cup that I like. I know I have some, some washi tape in here. I took it all out on the patio because my granddaughter and I were working out on the patio. And of course, since she's coming tomorrow, I didn't bring it all back in. <clears throat> I just, um, I'm not sure about why there's, there's a, a piece of wire on here. I don't know. It, it throws me every time. I mean, I I could have uh, put this down three times, but I don't understand the wire. There must there there might be a reason for that wire. So I'm I'm hesitant to use it. Um, what was the name of that show? Was it something like? Boom. Something like that. Um, man, I can't think of the name of that drum show. It's bothering me. It's 
So there's just all kinds of things going going on, but not this weekend. Oh, this is really sticky. Ooh. This is not going to be a repositionable stick. <laughs> that is yucky. Um, these are felt stars. And they are definitely needing to be used. I have had these for a good long while. I'm feeling the need to go on a road trip. I'm feeling the need to get out of Dodge and just go find something to do. Oh man, I'm definitely needing some baby wipe here. It's actually not a baby wipe, it is a disinfecting wipe. Seventh generation, no less. Okay, that feels better. The other one I've used for glue and other things, it wasn't wiping. It was wet and it was still able to be used to clean something, but there, I need that. I needed, I needed a clean wipe. Okay, I'm not gonna put any more stars on. I think I've let's see what's in this. You know what? This um, this is my little junk uh, my little junk uh, container, my desk junk container from Florida. Oh, I have it got up here. Okay, I think I want to use that. It's been sitting there long enough. I'm just going to fold that under. The nice thing about it is once it's in, it's in. There. Now I don't have to worry about it anymore. Okay. Oh, I wonder why that was. Nope. Okay, this is going to have to go at the bottom. Just cover all this up. Look at all that. Look at how soft that is. Remember I sent back the, the case because it was so soft? Well, I got just soft back in return. Sometimes this stuff comes really nice and firm, and sometimes it doesn't. Just on that side of
I should have looked on the other side to see what it was before just assuming that this was the side I was planning to use. <clears throat> but I didn't. And so now this is the side that will be used. Ends. and it's after midnight and I'm kind of thinking about doing that and I'm thinking I'm going to have to just pack this up so I will talk to you all later. Thanks for watching. And um, I'll talk to you later. <laughs> like I said.